Assalamualaikum How are you doing today? I hope you are doing good at home So it's me again Teacher Hani Your mathematics teacher So today we are going to learn The 7th um, Subtopic Okay 7th topic For year 4 Okay second last topic It's about coordinate Okay So you only have Two topic that you need to learn in year 4 Okay second last is coordinate And the last one is statistic so let's look what is coordinate okay actually coordinate is very interesting i love this topic very much okay so recognize and determine the coordinates okay look here this is a map of Cartesian plane shows the place of interest in a few district okay this is a Cartesian plane okay so look here it has number below, below here this is horizontal exist okay this is horizontal exist okay start from 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 okay actually this number can be anything okay it can be a b c or uh, name or anything right okay so but you need to look here okay for this line it is x exists okay we call this line as x exists Okay, horizontal axis is means by x axis. Axis to apa? Part C. Part C, x. Okay. Okay, horizontal. Okay, horizontal axis in Malay. We call it as part C mengufuk. Okay, part C mengufuk. Or in Malay, eh, eh, sorry, or in English, it calls horizontal axis. Okay, maksudnya dari sini ke, dari kosong ke belah kanan. Okay, kosong ke belah kanan. Ini adalah paksi X ataupun paksi mengufuk. Ataupun dalam bahasa Inggeris namanya horizontal axis. And we have vertical axis. Okay, this is a vertical axis from zero here until Number 6, it has 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and it stated Y. Okay, actually this is vertical axis ataupun dalam bahasa Melayunya nama Pak Si Mencancang. Pak Si Mencancang ataupun Y axis ataupun Y axis. Okay, Pak Si Y. Okay, ha, you kena ingat tiga-tiga nama ni. Dia ada tiga nama. Y axis, vertical axis or paksi mencancang. Yang ni paksi mengufuk ataupun horizontal axis ataupun Y axis. Okay, yang eh sorry X axis. Kalau X axis ni dari sini ke kanan. Kalau Y axis dari sini ke atas. Okay. So, look here. Okay, this girl said, Sejinjang waterfall. Where is Sejinjang waterfall? Okay, this is Sejinjang waterfall. Here is right. Okay, look at the dot here. This is the dot. Okay, lies on the horizontal axis. Dia berada di horizontal axis ni lah. Di atas garis paksi mengufuk. Or X axis. Okay, kuala pasir. Okay, where is kuala pasir here? Okay, this is the kuala pasir. Okay, kuala pasir is at vertical axis or y axis. Ha, macam teacher cakap tadi lah, teacher dah terangkan. Okay, so how to read the coordinate? Macam mana kita nak baca coordinate ni? Okay, the intersection point of x axis and y axis. Okay, inilah maksudnya. Paksi yang uh, apa? Uh, intersect. Okay, apa intersect? Anda dalam bahasa Melayu uh, yang... Tercantum, okay uh, This is X axis, this is Y axis So, it intersect here Okay, it's called origin Ini namanya origin O, O is for origin Okay, origin Okay, the coordinate of Idaman Beach, ni, Idaman Beach Here, okay Which is at the origin is written As 0, 0 Okay, cara tulis coordinate Mesti ada kurungan Okay, and then kita start. Kalau dekat origin, automatically we know that it is zero. Apostrophe, zero, tutup kurungan. Ha, macam korang pula. Okay. 
ada kurungan 0 apostrophe comma 0 and tutup kurungan ok so look at B Timon Lake ok which is Timon Lake ok here right ok this is the dot ok Timon Lake is 4 unit to the east maksudnya Timon Lake ok kita tahu ini adalah uh, map kan ok pernah nampak kataan N N means north ha, ni dah tulis dah north Ok, macam mana nak hafal? N-E-W-S News. Ok, kena hafal N-E-W-S News. N-E-W-S News. Eh? N-E-W-S. Ok, E is for East. W is for West. S is for South. Ok. Macam mana teacher nak tulis ni? S-O-U-T-H. Ok, South. Alamak salah, salah lah. Alamak salah pula. Salah lah teacher cakap tadi. Bukan macam tu aturannya ya. Okay, cancel this one. Ni salah. Okay, news tu betul. And. Sorry. And here. Okay, E here. W here. Okay, this is S. Okay, ingat eh. N, E, W, S. Ni salah. Kau jangan ingat. Aku orang ni. <laughs> this one yang, yang salah ni yang betul ya. This one. Okay. N, E, W, S. So, this is North, East, West, South. Okay. N, E, W, S. Okay. Dia macam ni. Baca N, E, W, S. So, North. Okay. So, um, kita baca bersemula apa tadi. Uh, 4 unit to the east ok maksudnya 4 unit to the east ke kanan 4 unit ke kanan so 1, 2, 3, 4 ok timun leg 4 unit ke kanan sebab east ke kanan kan ok and uh, 5 unit to the north ok north ke atas ok so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 ok so this is timun leg 4 unit to the north 4 kali ke kanan 5 kali ke atas ok so it is written as 4 ok mesti ada kurungan 4 ok kita baca dulu x axis yang bahagian bawah ni kita baca dulu x axis it is 4 ok and then we read y axis 5 4 apostrophe 5 ok tutup kurungan like that eh ok Okay, look at C. The coordinate of sejinjang waterfall. Okay, where is sejinjang waterfall? Here. Okay, sejinjang waterfall sini kan. Titik dia kan. Okay, kita baca dulu X axis dia. Bawah ni dulu. Okay, it is 4. Okay, tutup kurungan. 4, koma. And baca dulu juga Y axis. It is 0. Okay, so the coordinate for sejinjang 4, 0. Okay, and the coordinate of Kuala Pasir. Okay, where is Kuala Pasir? Okay, here is Kuala Pasir. Okay, kita baca dulu X axis dia. So, apa ni? Ha, macam mana tulis ni? Tutup kurungan 0 and then kita baca Y axis. It is 4. Okay, and Hill View Temple. This is a Hill View Temple. Okay, kita baca dulu bah bawahnya. This is 3 koma and then 0 ok to write a coordinate write the coordinate of x axis first kita baca dulu yang ini ini nombor 1 kita baca baru kita baca y nombor 2 ok so look at next ok the picture shows the position of 5 ferries at a harbour ok this is a harbour and uh, the ferries in the map ok which ferries are at 2 6. Okay, mana 2, 6. Okay, 2 is X axis, right? What 6 is Y axis. So, X axis is 2. Ni X axis 2. Okay, Y axis 6. So, uh, ni 2 P lah. Okay, so P is coordinate 2, 6. Okay, and... 4, 0. Okay, 4 ni yang X kan, yang bawah dulu. 
baru y okay x for zero okay so we know it is t okay t coordinate is for zero okay ferry p is at two p two six while terry sorry while ferry t is at four zero okay uh, state the ferry date are in the same row okay mana baris yang sama okay kita baca dulu coordinate S, S ni. Berapa koordinat dia? Sini here. Okay, kita baca bawah dulu. 0. And then kita baca Y axis. 3. Okay, koordinat R. It is 3. And then 3. Okay, for koordinat Q, it is 5 and 4. Easy, right? Easy. Kita baca je. Kita baca bawah, kita baca tepi. Kita baca bawah, kita baca tepi. Kita baca bawah, kita baca tepi. Ha, senang. Okay. So, this is the last um, example I give you. Okay. Based on the Cartesian plane. This is Cartesian plane yang ada X and Y ni. Okay. Fill in the empty boxes. Okay. The horizontal axis. Mana horizontal axis? Ingat lagi tak? Is X axis. Okay, the vertical axis is apa ni? Y axis. Okay. So, O is the origin. The coordinate for O is 0, 0. Set the coordinate of the clock and the lamp. Which is clock. This is clock, right? Okay, kita baca bawah dulu. 0, Kat mana nak stick ni? Nah, Z coordinate for the clock lah kita tulis kat bawah ni. Clock is 0, 2. Lamp, 4, 2. Okay. Is at 2, 0. 2, 0. Okay, what is this? Nombor apa ni lah? Picture kot. Picture. Okay, apa yang at 3, 3? Tree, tree. Oh, it's a flower. Okay, so done. Okay, so that's all for today. I hope you understand. But if you don't understand, you can repeat this video again. Okay, uh, ulang balik semula video ini dengar, dengan teliti ataupun tak faham, you can refer to your textbook okay so after that do activity book page 106 and 107 okay so that's all for today good luck and all the best goodbye